If you too long for the birth of Greater Finland, then fret no more. The Dreams of Finland mod is the mod for you. But first, if you're new around here, be sure to subscribe if you like this kind of content. I'd like to introduce you to the largest goddamn Finland focus tree I've ever seen. Oh boy. So this is the uh, the Dreams of Finland uh, mod for Hearts of Iron 4, uh, whereby there's a massive focus on, um, on well, on Sweden. I swear the jokes will get better, I promise. <laughs> yeah, we play, as, uh, we play as Finland and there's a lot of different things we can do. So we're going to start off with Russian trade profiteering. Um, I don't know what, how I'm going to play this, but I just know there's a lot of cool stuff like uh, returning the Swedish Empire, United Kingdoms of Sweden, Swindon. Oh, hopefully not, Jesus Christ. There's the pursuit of Greater Finland and that kind of stuff. So immediately going to go and stand on the border of the Soviet Union. I'm not going to lie, I spent the last couple of minutes just looking through this <laughs> Put down focus here. I'm lost in Hoi 4 at the best of times, alone this. Alright, well, let's get some manpower going, I suppose. Claim Nordic Unity. Now that's a dream. A finish. <laughs> the dream. Okay, I lied. The jokes aren't getting better. Uh, this is your warning from now. Alright, riots in the southern cities. <laughs> that sounds <laughs> promising. That was French. He just said qu'est-ce que c'est. That was not that was not finished. We're gonna crush them. We're gonna go, go down the, the whole crushing them route. Uh, I think that'll be fun. Not that I condone crushing riots. I suppose it's something I should probably say in the modern era. I have 6% stability. Well, that's, mm, that's gonna affect some things. Right, monarchy question, here we go. Oh, it's gone down to 0%, brilliant. So far I have hideously mismanaged the, the nation of Finland. I don't like the idea of that. I'm gonna go for the Finnish king of, of Finland because I feel like if we just sort of sign a personal union with uh, with Sweden, that wouldn't go well for our nation. Which means we've got to crown the father of the nation. God, there's a lot of different options. I always like it when a mod has all these different options. So if I went down the German route, I could do, I could do this. If I went down the Swedish route, I've got, I can either go down this kind of route or I could do the whole Swedish empire and, and, and that stuff, which is pretty cool. Um, but no, I think I'm gonna stick with uh, stick with Finland. There we go, Kingdom of Finland. His name is Karl Mannerheim. That doesn't sound very <laughs> Swedish. Why would it be Swedish? That doesn't sound very Finnish, is what I meant to say. My God. I mean, realistically, we're gonna be fighting the Soviets. I think that's that's all the route I'm going down. All right, we're back up to 66% stability. This, this nation's getting whiplash with the amount of stability stuff that's going on. I mean, Stalin does have the purge for the next three years, um, which you know makes me tempted just to go for them. But equally, I don't think that's a very good idea considering that we don't have enough guns to arm our troops right now. Looking at this focus tree, um, it looks like I've picked the weakest possible path for, for Finland. I've, I've been looking at the other ones, and the other way is Finland actually gets to... I don't know how to describe it, like, entered into alliances with people? And this is the only one where the only person we get is, is Sweden. I mean, I could have joined Germany and fought the Soviets like that, but no, I'm now... I've just been left with Sweden. I mean, put it this way, I don't, I don't really see us advancing at all. I see us sort of sitting here and waiting for the uh, for the Germans to do something. Canada declares independence. What? <laughs> India declares independence. Why? What did you do? Oh, you're communist. Oh, what did... That's <laughs> great. So, does that mean that you're... Okay, so Canada is now alone. Okay. Yeah, this this makes sense. This is fine. Australia, yeah, they've all they're, they're all independent. That's the whitest Indian man I've ever seen in my life. Well, there go the allies. Oh Jesus! Oh, and there goes France. Apparently, your al well, okay. So the Axis is now ridiculously overpowered. Brilliant. Well, I'm gonna try and ally Sweden. Just hope they say something positive. I really should have gone down the German route. I hope you accept Sweden because this kind of screws me over. Oh, brilliant. Okay, that's good. They've they've joined the alliance. That's nice. I'm sort of prepping for war against the Soviets when uh, I'm really not ready. Decolonization. Okay. So you just you looked at Germany and you thought, yep, yeah, now's the time. And you're on your own. You're just allied to these guys. Yep. So there goes the... Uh, it looks like the Italians didn't get anything. Uh, Spain is sort of split. France between them and... Oh, God, there's so much going on now. What do you mean? They're almost capable. What? You can't be the leader of this. It's my... I'm the main character. It's my video. Right, we go. Pursue a greater Finland. This is the smartest idea. And Indians declared war in India. The world is, is gone to hell. Zambia, Zimbabwe, and Malawi. They're just sitting here like, mm, let's just... If we don't move, they won't notice us. Japan declared war on communist China. Okay, so the Japanese invasion of China is going pretty well. India is now blue. 
and the same guy is in charge. So I'm a little bit confused at the how he was able to play both sides there. There we go. They've still got their officers purged by like minus five. So that's not really going to help. Right. They get the Great Patriotic War. Yeah, against Finland. All right. Are we going to hold? Okay. So it looks like we're holding in most. And you, um, you pushed into Leningrad. You've, why have you done that, Sweden? <laughs> have you managed to take Leningrad? Well, we've lost Leningrad now. Okay, let's stop attacking. We'll just defend, please. God, for the love of God, just defend. Well, I, I mean, look, any opportunity to make it smaller. So let's let's just quickly do that. I'll cut off some troops. Look at this, look at this encirclement maneuver. Ah! Oh! Uh, Sweden, are you sure an assured naval invading this island is what you want to do? Really? It's bold. I don't know why I'm pushing. There is little to no point in pushing here. But I, I want to. I'm going to push to Leningrad. That seems like a reasonable thing to do. I, he might, like, is he fighting the Japanese or something? Yeah. Okay. That, that'll be where his troops are. This isn't a smart... I think I might have just cut off this entire northern front, you know. Huh. Interesting. I have. Oh, God! Get the reinforcements in, boys! How many divisions is that? 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. About 15 divisions up here. That's actually sizable. I've killed 150,000 of their troops. My god. Yeah, I think these... Oh, god. I think they're holding. Right, we need to push in. Really need to start pushing in. We're on low manpower. I, I know we're on low manpower. We need more men. I might just go straight to service by requirement. Uh, but I think... I think it's mobilizing a little bit more. Come on, we need to cut off this area before the Soviets push. Jesus Christ, we might, we're actually getting somewhere. Come on, make it, make it. Nice, overrun, excellent. Right, in Sarkovan. Oh, oh, put that one on the Reddit. No, <laughs> I'm not fighting all that, lads. <laughs> I'm not doing it. So who are you all with? You are at war with Italy and stuff. Why? Am I at war with them? No, why, why are you all with Italy? Swedish Soviet war. Yeah, for some reason, Sweden is fighting against the Axis and the Comintern. I don't know why they're fighting the Axis. I'm not joining in. Looks like they're going to take that fort. They're going to take that fort. This is bad. This is really bad. Okay, quick, get it back. Quick, get it back. Okay, good. Man, these Finns are really going for it. All right, this is really bad. They're breaking through the fort lines. Quick, boys, I need you to finish these guys off real quick. Oh, come on, lads, hold, please. We're so close. Why? You just stay there. You're breaking. You're leaving the four lines open. Okay, I have another line of forts down here. I saw. I do have two, so we'll see. But I think the best thing is for us to cut off this this northern lot. Seven visions from the Germans. That is actually ridiculously useful. Oh god, they're breaking through in the south. I'm gonna have to redirect some boys south. All right, let me quickly show off what's going on. Right, so you've got. This, I mean, the Germans won Europe pretty much entirely. Um, and they've got their axis that controls everything. The Union of Britain split up, decolonized, um, and has a couple of allies here or there. Uh, nothing really too special. Um, and then you've got our front line, which is rapidly, like, breaking in the south. And they're going to run to Helsinki. But there are five Swedish divisions there. Um, meanwhile, I'm trying to make the stupidest encircling maneuver of my life. Come on, come on, come on, guys, we got this. Technically, these guys are encircled, just... Please go. How's the southern front doing? Oh, they, they push us back beyond the fort line. This is bad. Wait, hang on. What's this? An investment portfolio. You know what? This is a great time to invest in Turkey. Man, it's 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 very close here. Oh, we got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Please. Oh, God, I need this. Just in my life, I need this right now. This is huge. Oh, my God. That's so many. That's so many. Is it done? It's done. Right. How many have they killed? How many have they lost? How many have they lost? We've killed 660,000. We've lost 88,000 to be fair. We are dying from manpower and lack of guns. But we're in a really, really nice spot now. Yeah, I'm doing a tactic in Hoi 4, really pro strat, where it's called um, ignoring the problem. Where I'm not looking at the fact that they're breaking through over here. I'm, I'm just more looking at my own smaller encirclements. Kill a couple of troops here. See, now this is the chill part of the war, where I can just go ahead and just take them out, right? Here we go! Greater Finland. Ah, oh, Kingdom of Greater Finland. That's exactly what we wanted to see. Jesus Christ. All right. I think it's time we, uh, I think it's time we just went for a general assault on the Soviets. Go. 
make it happen. Oh dear, he's gonna get cut off, isn't he? Go, run! All right, lads, we gotta we gotta get him out. Saving Private Water Finish name the Helsinki. <laughs> that's not that's not a finished name. I actually don't have any guns, I don't think, anymore. Well, that's fine. We don't need guns where we're going. How many have we killed? We have killed about 863,000 of them. They've killed about 161,000 of us. 33%. Yeah, okay. Oh, God. Hang on. Well, there goes my ally. They're in their war against... Uh, I mean, Sweden's fighting everyone. Jesus Christ. I was a bit busy in the East to come and protect you. And there doesn't seem to be any... Goddamn Soviets anymore. The Soviets are 98% of the way towards capitulation. My contributions dropped down to 20% now. The Germans have killed a million. I've almost killed a million. There we go. And the Soviets are gone. I think the Union of Britain joined in so we don't get our like nice little peace deal. But I'm happy with the Kingdom of, uh, of Greater Finland um, and I suppose the sacrifice of our friend Sweden. Jesus Christ. In all, quite a uh, quite a cool mod. I like the, the there's lots of replayability here. Like you can go down this whole Return of the Switch Empire tree, and you get locked out of all the Finnish ones, and you can do all this stuff, like um, merging the stock exchanges and other riveting things. Um, I um I've been enjoying playing sort of a lot of Hearts Five Four mods, and so it just occurred to me that I should be recording this kind of stuff. So if you have any sort of mods you'd like me to play or any suggestions, please leave them in, in the uh, the comments down below. Otherwise, I'll see you next time. Thank you guys for watching. Please make sure to subscribe. Goodbye.